For 2006, SolidWorks has added a camera feature. Notice this uh, water treatment plant. You can see that there's a lot of information, a lot of uh, different components in here. We also have uh, a, a mannequin that actually walks through. We can actually run an animation here. And you can see that we have a mannequin that walks through our plant. And he'll kind of walk around as we go. We'll come back and use that in a little bit. Uh, as I mentioned, one of the things we've added is a camera feature. What the camera does, it allows us to set up some visual properties about um, how we want to view our geometry or how we want to view what we're looking at on the screen. Notice is I can that I can interactively move my camera around and I get on the right hand pane, I get an updated camera view. It's also taking care of the perspective automatically for me. These are very easy to position position them around anywhere we want on our design. We can even go inside of things and SolidWorks will automatically clip off information behind what we're what we're trying to view so we can get actually get inside of this tank here and see what it looks like. So you can see it's clipping information away from the backside. Now one of the things we want to do with this camera is to uh, attach it to our mannequin as he walks through the plant here. So we can set up the target but just by selecting the uh, some sketch information out of our mannequin and we'll also set up the um, information there. We can control the roll. If we wanted to do that, we could set that information as well. So we'll go ahead and accept that. Now all we need to do is access this standard view and it takes us right to our view orientation. If we go back to our animation, our animation will now not just be a static animation, but it'll actually be a plant walkthrough. So some great new visualization tools for SOLIDWORKS 2006.